Good evening. I'm kind of sleepy tonight. How's everybody doing? It's been a little while since we played this one, you know? Get all my stuff here set up. I think we're all good. Been a little while. But it is the sound of the summer. Where were we in this game? Oh, yeah. Let me check the weather. Ooh, that was a little... Something. Hung for a moment. Ah, good evening, everyone. How's your Saturday been? I, uh... Oh my goodness. Okay, it's tough yawning. Oh. I went out for some lunch with some friends. Right, these elves. Uh-oh. That was not what I meant to do. I gotta remember my buttons here. God, how do I even play this game? There we go. Yeah, I, um... Yeah, I love those guys. I went out for some Hawaiian food with some pals today. And, uh... Boy, that made me sleepy, being out in the rain. Walked around a little bit. and Ate a lot of very good food that has me very, very full. Oh, right, I have a big backpack now. I can hold... Hold more stuff. Yeah, it was yummy. Uh, I'm actually gonna leave these behind for now. Probably go buy some more seeds. I oh god, it's been a little while since I played this game. Really remember what I was doing. All right, I can charge it, though. I've been feeling the itch to play this again. I thought that would... There we go. Oh, thank you. Wait, oh, hang on. It didn't pop up on the screen. Stream. Stream. Screen, stream, not scream. Jesus, I am tired. Let me fix that really quick. Should have popped up. That was... Oh, maybe it did and I just completely missed it. Wow, I am tired. Can y'all tell how freaking sleepy I am? Good lord. This will probably be a kind of short, low key one. Yeah, drink water. That's a good idea. That'll wake me up, honestly. Yeah, I've been, it's, you know, it's rainy and cold, and as you can probably tell from the aesthetic of my stream, I'm, I'm always more about the summer vibes. You know, I still, I still like winter, you know? I just, uh... Oh, shit, I'm out of water. Takes me a little more time to get used to it sometimes, and some days it just knocks me on my ass. Oh god, I can never tell what I've watered and what I haven't, but they'll theoretically help me with whatever I miss. But I'm still thinking about uh, that stream we had the other day, where I played... Um, Magic carpet and uh, Strider 2. God, Strider 2 was really fun. I'm still thinking about that. Is this ready to cut? No, my sickle's in the thing. Oh, yeah? Mm. 
god. <laughs> I see. Yeah, I was like trying to, I was like staring, I was like, do I do I just not am I tired enough that I don't get it? But now I get it, yeah, yeah. It makes <laughs> it makes more sense. Uh that's really funny. Can I cut this yet? No, I can't. I love that sound. Cat sneeze. Well, that was. I don't have any cows yet. <sighs> yeah, Strider 2 is extremely full of love. That's a very good way to describe that game. It's also full of just mashing. I That is a good way to annihilate a controller. God, I love it. Oh, the chickens are down here. Yeah, I love how much Strider 2 just expects you to just bash the fuck out of it. Like, fuck, like, hit stop or, like, recovery frames. Those are for cowards. You're going to hit this button as hard as you can. That. This game is a struggle. I think that was the yolk of the egg, not not the chick inside. I'm I'm gonna really hope that's that was the yolk. That had to be the yolk, or I'm gonna flip my shit and never be unflipped. That would be so fucked. <laughs> Part of me wants to break an egg just to, like, make sure. Uh, my eggs. Yay! What are you guys doing? Tell me y'all got nothing to do out here. Goofing off. I mean, I guess they're done for the day. I have a ton of work for them. That's that's for the best, right? You know. Okay, I was like, trying to be like, is this doing anything? I, yeah, I haven't played this game in a little while, so I'm, I'm a little rusty, to be honest. First, uh, first several streams we did were of this game. Yeah, I love, like, 2D sprites on the PS1. 3D backgrounds, 2D sprites on it. That's, that's the good shit. Oh, there's a, they tease the new Story of Seasons? No, I haven't seen that. It's a remake of Wonderful Life. Interesting. I like that game a lot, too. I'll have to, I'll have to watch that. Made you cry? Aw. That's cute. Yeah, it sounds, uh... Hang on. See if I can find. Oh yeah, I see some screenshots of it now. Oh yeah, my dog's name is Swim. I I can't help it. I always name. I always name an animal Swim. I 
I love that shit. I my uh, chocobo in Final Fantasy fourteen is named Swimp. Has been since uh. There we go. I had to pet my dog. Oh, the keyboard elves? Yeah, those are the harvest sprites. They're little elves. They live in the wood, the woods behind the church, and you can get them to come to your farm and just, like, help you with your farm work. They don't even really expect you to, like, pay them or anything, which I think is interesting. They just, they just kind of help you out. I'm not really sure if... Oh, hang on. Rick's here. I'm gonna slowly walk in from off screen. Oh, it's the chicken festival. I have to bring a chicken to the square tomorrow. Okay. We'll do that. Let's get the let's get the chickens out really quick. Okay. Everybody goes in the damn damn fence. Yeah, I, I feel like they're, the, maybe the dwarves, like the elves, the sprites work better or faster if you pay them. But they don't really like, like if you don't do anything for them, like if you don't give them items or anything, they don't like stop showing up or anything. So I, I don't really know what the deal is. Just like they're working for free? You're just doing it for the love of the game? Maybe they just like working. Weird like that. You think she really love farming sims? Yeah, me too. I mean, basically, I'm doing a bunch of farming for free in some sense of it. Other players engaging in co-op? Wow. On the uh on the PS1. they all become a harvest sprite. Yeah, that's probably true. That's fine. I'd be good at it. You, uh, you can't hire them in spring because they're too busy having a month-long tea party. Which, also, respect. Moon is a game in which you can make social connections, win games, find eggs, and solve riddles. You know, you're not wrong. You gotta be a harvest sprite if you want to be in the month long tea party. You know, probably. Drink water. Oh my god, I will do that. I'm chugging today. And again, I didn't have any water. Yeah, that's. Yeah, I, uh. God, I went out for lunch today and I the line and like the place we went to the line was so long that it was like out the door and like there was nowhere to sit in the place so we had to kind of take our food elsewhere and then afterwards I was like well I forgot to get a drink and now I have a giant plate of like chicken katsu and rice and macaroni salad so I I did not have a lot of siphon which was unfortunate when it was a, a very... Oh, it was so good, though. Yeah, it was so worth it. But yeah, you know, all that, like, fried chicken and, like, soy sauce and stuff. 
and a technically spicy it was, it was a it was a spicy ish meal it you know i say spicy ish because it was just like a chicken katsu with like a sriracha aioli on it which isn't like that's not that spicy i'm not a big spice person like i can't handle a ton of heat but like sriracha that's that shit is pretty handleable i think by most people's standards i think except for uh one of my partners cannot handle heat at all and every time i put anything like even the tiniest bit of heat in anything they're just like Ugh, uh. i don't i don't know how they're how they can live gotta have a little bit you know Oh yeah, everybody's been streaming Pizza Tower and it's made you want pizza. Yeah, me too. I, w I just want to play Pizza Tower, honestly. That game looks super sick. Farm, yeah. We f we're farming. rock uh, yeah okay look look farming comes in many forms okay digging around mining that's farming for rocks see just got one the crop is abundant this year i don't want these though this shit can get fucked yeah oh yeah i'm good at that kind of farming too jesus christ How am I mine from? That's what I'm fucking saying. I'm always asking this Monday. That checks out. That sounds like a thing Jop would do. Love that guy. Super cool dude. I mean, I'm I'm out here eating rocks. Oh, okay, I'm, I'm actually up here. That is Goron behavior. I mean, if I was going to be a Zelda... If I was going to be like a Zelda enemy, or like species of any kind, not even enemy. If I was going to be a Zelda species, it'd probably be a Goron. Like, even though I am generally water-aspected, I like to think. Where to upgrade my house. Yeah, I'm... I'm one of those Gorons that's like... Yeah, yeah, exactly, exactly. You got it. I was gonna say, yeah. I'm, I'm one of the Wind Waker Gorons. Ooh, a Rito would be nice, too. I feel like I, feel like I have Rito vibes, too, with how much I love, like, flight games. Maybe there's something I can do here. Yeah, you're definitely Azora. You're definitely Azora. I don't even I don't even have to like question that. I'm just like, yeah. 100 percent God, it's roasting my ass. <laughs> what Zelda type like character type are you is a very good question to ask I think I feel like there, there's a lot to be said about you know examining yourself in that way okay I gotta fucking figure out oh wait no the the lumber guy is the uh Well, it's not like I don't actually have a ton of a uh, ton of money right now, so I should. Yeah, Charlie, I think you are aspected in the way of like a little bit. You're you're a little bit Korok and a little bit of a Goron, I think. That's and a little bit real. You got a lot going on, Charlie. You have multitudes. You still love me if I was the link to the past worm? Yes, absolutely.
I always liked the little bunny that Link turns into in a uh, Link to the Past when you go into the Dark World. It's a bunny, right? I'm not just misremembering that. Come on, I want to pick. Okay. Bunny's extremely good. That's a that's a good emote. Damn. Spiky bull ball enemies in the Wind Waker Forest Dungeon. Oh, the um the ones that like the um the like moth guys can like spit out. Love those guys. They make really funny little sounds. Ugh. There's a there's a Wind Waker stream on the horizon here. I'll tell you that. Uh, me and one of my partners are going to play uh, Wind Waker Randomizer Run at some point. Do it co-op style, you know? Both run in the same seed and kind of going in different directions on it. I think that'll be a lot of fun. I feel like I've just been running in circles this whole day. I should put the chickens up before I fucking go to bed and just leave them out. I thought also, Doro, I thought your tummy was not it was your tummy not a backpack. You were just eating eggs and getting a big belly. I am. That's me. In real life. Eating hella eggs. Hey, dude. What's up? No more work. All good. Nothing left to do. Chickens. Where's my horse? What's this guy doing? Hell yeah. Oh god, there's so many weeds over here. Uh. Oh, the uh... Yeah, 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 yeah. The harvest sprites. We were just talking about them a minute ago. They are little like they're little helper guys. My PNG has a snark button. Uh, I feel like this is the closest I have to a snark button. Uh, most of most of my emotes are pretty pretty positive. Oh no, this guy fell asleep. Yeah, I got a, let me see, I got a little kind of squinted eyes for when I'm excited or laughing really hard. Got a little happy one. Got heart eyes. This is the kind of half, half lid. Huh, one of them's not working. I'll have to tinker with that. This is my shocked. Then I like the combination of the half lid and the sweat. And I have a focus one. Yeah. Uh, my partner, uh, Charlie, did all of those. She's in the chat as a uh, now sprout. I have to, yeah, there you are. Yeah, I had to I had to make sure I had the name right because she kind of uses both snout sprout and sprout snout, and I was like, oh god, which which one? Yeah, I never found my horse. I got distracted by the funny elf. So glad this has a jump button. It kind—it's like kind of a jump button. It's like a—it's like a Zelda jump. It's contextual. I do need to find my horse. Yeah, you can't just like jump around in this game, though. I wish you could. I'd be way into that. Find my horse and go to PF Chang's. That's what I'm fucking saying. That, that might be the greatest tweet of all time. It's hidden right now, but my actual favorite tweet is uh, generally visible down here. NASA just revealed a heaven-like planet where you can drink a beer at the lake, and they're calling it Earth. That is, that is a very Nadia Core post, I think. <laughs> I, I I don't you know I don't I don't love beer in general so I have to admit if I'm gonna drink it's gonna be like 
I like, I like a nice hard cider, you know? Or, uh... Ooh, I'll tell you, I found some, like... I don't know if it was local or what, but... found some, like, guava cider the other day that I was, like, way into. Where is my fucking horse? Beer with a little grenadine or lime. Ooh, hoo, 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 that sounds nice. Ah, there's my horse. Charlie, grow up fast. My horse is still a baby, and as such, I cannot ride the horse. Yeah, guava cider's nice. It's, uh. I'm talking about my partners nonstop, but like. Have I had a shandy? Yes, I have had a shandy once in my life. I think. Let me let me double check if a shandy is what I think it is. Yeah, it's like it's a uh, beer and like something else usually, right? Like uh I think um so doxing myself from like 10 years ago. I used to live in southeast Alabama, and there was this uh, brewery out in the middle of the country. A shandy is, where, is what hangs on the ceiling in a fancy ballroom. True. Yeah, yeah, beer and lemonade. That's what it was. Um, there was a little brewery out in the middle of nowhere near my hometown back in Alabama. And every once in a while, we would go out there because they, um, they did local beer, but they also brewed, um, they brewed their own mead. Which I really liked. And so we would go out there sometimes and just sit by the fire and like drink mead or stuff like that. And they had a. Um, it wasn't. They called it a rattler, I think. Yeah, which is, like, very similar to a Shandy, right? Like, they're basically the same thing. Um, like, yeah, it was, um... I I think it was... Generally, like, they had a red ale and a... It was, like, lemonade or some kind of fruit... Like, sour fruit drink like that. Ugh, that was so good. That's... I don't, I don't go back down there very often... But if I did, that would be the reason. Okay, these elves are getting to work. Oh yeah, I never finished explaining the harvest sprites again for you, Dora. They are just little like guys that live in the woods, and if you ask them, they'll come and work on your farm for a few days. No. Help you water your crops, harvest stuff for you. How do I check? See, there's helper elves in Italian. Is that how you say that word, Italian? Is it French? I've, been, I've never played any of those games. I really need to. I, every time I hear about them, I'm just like, these, I would, I would love to play these. Keep hitting the wrong button. Dream one? <laughs> yeah, I, I will, I will. I, uh, I, I will do that. Also, yeah, they would, they would love some, oh, God, I want to, I want to make a big pot of, like, curry or something for the, the harvest sprites. Just walk in with like a big thing, a big pot of rice and a big uh, big thing of uh, curry. No, don't make it out. Of, don't make it out of them. No. <laughs> I don't remember why all these are named these. I'm pretty sure this is y'all's fault, or y'all in the grand scheme of things. Like, I don't remember who named these. 
I think I just like asked for names from the chat. His name is Cheese. Yeah, the royal, y'all. Also, I love the like the we are the dwarves and we like some stew post. That is like that's an all-timer. This is probably the one I'm looking for. Yeah, this is this is my most this is my most beloved chicken apparently. This is the first one. Like, look at look at those hearts. This this chicken's gonna fuck everybody's shit up. I was thinking about that the the dwarves post the other day when I was playing Dwarf Fortress on stream. Boy, that was that was a fun stream if anybody missed that one. I tweeted about this after the fact, but a bunch a bunch of my dwarves got stuck in a tree because uh they were they were all up in a tree gathering fruit and then Akia, like the parrot, like came down and stole the step ladder they were on and they all got stuck in the tree and I didn't realize for days. War Fortress is a good video game. None of them died somehow. I genuinely cannot believe none of my dwarves died. That's that's where they're getting the ladders to sell at IKEA. They're just stealing them from these dwarves. I'm telling you, this conspiracy goes all the way to the top. the clock hits 10 or like close to it we'll start walking over there I'm, uh, I'm not gonna save scum this one like I did with um uh, like I did with the swimming one I don't I don't remember who all was here for that one but hey where did that chicken go okay god isn't it great like just just running around doing Doing normal farm stuff. I love them. I love farm games. I love farm games so much, y'all. I love farm games. I... Uh, for a while, I thought Stardew had, like, ruined me on farm games. You know, just being like, this one's so easy to play and so much quality of life that I can't go back. I was wrong. Oh my god, I forgot the premise of this. <laughs> what the fuck? That's an insane thing to say! That guy is going through it every day of his life. <laughs> We both screenshotted at the same time. Good, good, good. Uh, that's really funny. Monday, I'm sorry I missed your uh, your stream this morning. I, it's funny. I woke up around like noon and I could hear you like winding down because I, you know, I heard about you know what happened with Amos' connection. But I kind of yelled to. Charlie across the the house and I was like tell Monday I love them I was just like half awake and then I think you ended the stream pretty much immediately after so I ran you off I, I was like I slept so much that I was like out wait no no I hate this game. Okay, we saved just a minute ago, right? Okay, you know what? Give me a sec, I'm resetting.
think reset broke it. Hang on. Oh, for God's sake. I can't believe how easily I just fumbled that. It's not save scumming if... Listen. It's not save scumming if I just... Maybe it is. You know what? Yeah, you, uh, you've you proven me a liar. But it's fine. I'm, I'm working on getting this fixed. <laughs> Hang on. Why isn't... Why isn't this showing up? There it goes. Okay. Listen. It's not fun if I just, like, accidentally skip the event, you know? Especially because I was like... I walked up to him with my chicken. He's like, oh, are you entering a chicken? I'm just like, no. Wait, are you telling me to shut up? Or... <laughs> Because, like, fair, if so, I would understand. <laughs> okay. Okay. <laughs> oh, my God. Okay, is, is this the chicken festival day? Okay, cool. Oh, my Lord. I can't believe this, this game. I'm a disaster. I'm sorry. Good God. Okay, let's uh, let's let's get this let's get our shit together here. I'm I'm deeply embarrassed that that happened. Puppy four twenty, hell yeah. God. I gotta, we gotta start thinking about emotes for my channel. I've been thinking a little bit about it. Is this one named Donkey? Who named these fucking chickens? <laughs> Whose fucking chickens are these? Good and way too long mode name. <laughs> yeah, I'm actually not sure how, like, what the character limit is. Yeah, that is a long one. Oh, I gotta... Oh, excuse me. Didn't have time to scramble for the mute button. I just... Oh, thank you. You'll notice that anytime I sneeze, it's going to be upwards of four or five times. Like... Both times I've had sneezing fits today, it's been six sneezes. Cannot sneeze a normal amount of times. Whew, my goodness. <laughs> really, really blew your mind with how much I can sneeze, huh? I don't know what it is. I was gonna try to come up with a reason for it, but I, I genuinely don't know. You know, it, it makes up for the fact that I don't have many like allergies or anything like that. That's my that's my one weird trick. 
streamers don't want you to know about. Streamers hate her. I don't, I don't fucking know what this bit is. Look, I don't, I don't, I don't know. Look, I don't know. One giant sneeze that upsets your cat. That's, uh, that's what, that's what Neil Armstrong said when he landed on the moon. My chat instantly clears out. Everyone just gets up and leaves. That joke was basically nonsense. I'm an idiot. I'm going to take this chicken. I'm going to actually do the fucking chicken festival this time. Tell I'm tired because I'm making incomprehensible jokes. Ugh. I, uh... Need to get next week's schedule together also. Uh, I wanted to say, I'm probably going to play a lot of Hi-Fi Rush. I don't know how many streams that'll be, but uh, I'm, I'll am i probably play some of that on Monday and just like go. You know what I mean? Like, I don't know how much of it I'm going to play, but it's going to be a lot. Finish talking to everybody here. This guy hates, this guy hates chickens for some reason. What's your problem? <laughs> Thank you. Okay, let's see. Okay, let's talk to this guy. Let's not fuck this up this time. Yes, I am. Okay, let's do it. Let's do it. Not gonna save scum. Scam. Save scum. Jesus. Oh God. Oh, these are some good. These are some good names. We got Tenga is mine. We have uh, Sonia. Shout outs to VTuber friend Sonia. Spelled differently, but still. Uh, Foster Flowler. Not Fowler. Flowler with an extra L in there. Mad Dog. Yokozuna, uh, Conan, and Big Mama. There's urge their chickens on. Pressing the X button urges your chicken on. It's the button when your chicken is primed and clucking. I'm taking a bunch of screenshots here. But give the other chicken a fright. The other guy's chicken is in front. Scare it and send it running away. If you do a good job urging your chicken on, you can send the other chicken out of the ring. This is chicken sumo. But if you urge your chicken on when it is at the edge of the ring, you might send it out. So be careful. Got all that? Yeah, okay. I think so. Okay, Let, let's see how well this goes. Holy shit, I fucking iced them. Let's go. Let's go. Big Mama lost. I can't believe that. I was really hoping to fight Big Mama in the end. my god, I just fucking absolutely waxed that chicken. Okay, it all comes down to this. place isn't bad for year one, right? Yeah. There's always next year. I talked a bunch of... <laughs> Look. <laughs> How could I not be excited about... How could I not be excited for Chicken Sumo? Let me see what everybody's got to say now that I'm done here. 
What? What the fuck? What is? What are you saying about my hen, Rick? Rick? That's the most passive aggressive thing anyone's ever said to me in this game. Fucking weak sauce. Ugh. Oh, no. Hey, wait, no. You gotta come with. It's fine. I got second place. I don't feel bad about it. I don't feel bad. It's fine. Everybody's fucking, like, pitying me now. What? No! We... <laughs> we got second place! That's good! Yeah! Wait! No! <laughs> I was with him until the end! Not impossible, I just... God... something wrong with I'm not not a fr see thank you this guy has my back okay thank you thank you mayor Thank you. See? The mayor and the blacksmith. They had my back. I like I like that the blacksmith just said good work. Because you know what? Second place. That's that's still pretty good. Thank you for joining, Farmsteads. See you next time. Thank you for hopping in. I will enjoy being a possum. Oh, there's my horse. You know, I don't feel bad about it. And play dead and hang on my tail. Oh, that... Maybe for... You know, I was originally thinking the, like, end of stream thing should be, like, me in a hammock or something. But now I'm like, what if I'm like hanging out of a tree by my tail? Not that like, I don't think possums actually do that. But they don't, you know, that would be cute, wouldn't it? Nature's hammock. I don't think possums actually hang from their tails. I don't think possum tails are prehensile. They're just like big rat tails. I don't think possums have tails. Okay, hang on. Well, hold on just a second here. Pulling up, uh, my, my full design. You can see this is, yeah, I've got a, I've got a funny little tail. You can see, you can see that on me. My, uh, I need to actually fix it so my VTuber model is my whole body and not just upper, because... It's just, it's waist up. But yeah, no, yeah. The socks and sandals are essential. You have to have that. Like, who do you think, who do you think I am? That, nothing defines me as a person more than funny little socks and sandals. Also, my skirt looks like a trash can. That was intentional. But yeah. What was I? What was? Oh yeah, possum tails. Yeah, possums have tails. Oh, son of a bitch! Gotta get all these chickens inside so that 
stray dogs don't fuck them up. They wait, their tails are prehensile? What? Can they probably not strong enough to hold their whole body? Interesting. I've never seen a possum like I feel like I'm getting pranked. Am I being lied to? Because I'm very gullible. Use it to help them climb. Oh, okay. That's fun. Yeah, I do that. Always climbing palm trees. I'm the possum equivalent of like a coconut crab. Hey, dude. Y'all chilling over here? Yeah, I could have killed you. Just snuck up on you and smoked your ass. I think this might be the last day they work for me. No, three more days. Also, yeah, here's all here's all their names if you want to see. I didn't name them. This is just this is their names. God, I wish I could just pick up the, the harvest bright thing. Wait, hang on, hang on, hang on, hang on. I'm gonna. <gasps> oh, the oh my God. Okay, uh, that's the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Okay, look at holy shit, y'all. I need you to see this photo. Fucking save it as a web p. Get fucked. Fuck. Oh my god. Okay, hang on. Browser. Gonna work? Yeah. Holy shit. Look at that. It's babies. That's that's so cute. That's the cutest thing I've ever seen in my life. Look at them. They're little worms. They are little worms. That's babies. They're so small. Sounds like they can't do that much more than this. And they don't, they don't sleep hanging by them or anything. It's a myth. But, oh my god. Duh. They're so cute. I'm going to cry. It's the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. I'm learning so much about myself today. As in me as a possum. Buddy. I sleepy. Ran out of work. That's fair. Possum tree bears its fruit. Yeah. Yeah, maybe, uh, maybe I'll... Oh, puppy. Sorry, I, my dog was being cute. In-game. I don't have a dog in real life. <laughs> I would have learned a lot more about animals. I'll watch the... I'll watch the VOD. I'll watch the VOD. Uh... Oh! Okay, let's... Oh, boy. A hurricane. Well, some of my crops are going to get hella fucked up, I think. Um, let's see if we can get the horse up. I don't think the horse could actually get hurt by a hurricane. But I don't want to take the risk. A lot more about animals in the Monday stream. Yeah, I'm... I'm curious about curious about that i think i overheard a little bit and i saw i saw screenshots from the stream saw something about a bird oh my god horse Because there's a hurricane tomorrow, and I want to get my horse back into the barn so it doesn't get owned by the hurricane. I don't think it will. I have to go to bed? Yeah, I know, but my horse has to...
look, this is... Oh, oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sorry, look, I'm doing my best. Yeah, you have to go to bed, Charlie. <laughs> look, I'm sorry, I'm scatterbrained tonight. All right. Am I gonna like pass out at midnight? There we go. Okay. Let's go. Let's go, 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 go. Scramble. Sprint to bed. Go to sleep, streamer. Yeah. <laughs> no, don't, don't clap your hands in front of my face. I'll scream. I'm very, very sensitive to being startled. <laughs> Every time someone startles me, I cry. Straight up. It happens weirdly frequently. This morning. Well, maybe I won't tell that story because I think if I tell the story about what happened this morning, Charlie might feel bad. Oh my god! Whole fucking house is shaking. Drink water, but I just drank. No, well, it wasn't water. Now I'll tell the story. Earlier I was in bed and Charlie got in for a second, but she landed right on my like leg when she did. And I screamed and then I cried. But it wasn't because it hurt as much as it was because it startled me because I was half asleep. It did hurt, but it was mostly because of startling. Yeah. Dropped the knee like right on my fucking like shin. So uh, we... God, I can't believe how much the whole fucking, like, place is shaking. I don't think I can go outside. Yeah, it straight up will not let me leave the house. I don't know why I saved on the day I can't. <laughs> it's just a mid but No, that was a low. I was not prepared. I was going for the overhead. Charlie somehow hit me with the jump in low. I've never seen that in my life. The aerial low. She's overpowered. Oh, that's a really good emote. Is that a... Yeah, it's one of Marigolds. Oh, that's a really cute emote. Okay. We're back on it. We're back here. God, demon flip. Uh, this music. Uh-oh. Oh, right. This girl's kind of sweet on me. Let's see what we lost here. Um, well, all things considered, we didn't. It wasn't that bad. Yeah, this is theme of surviving a hurricane. I always like the summer music in this game a lot. Yeah, the um that hurricane usually causes more problems, breaks more crops than that. But it only broke one of my crops, so I'm pretty happy with that, I guess. deliver three eggs to the inn every day starting tomorrow. Was it starting today? It's tomorrow. Oh, 
That sounds good. I didn't acknowledge it, but I did do it, Charlie, when you did the posture check and asked me to drink water. I did do it. Drink water, oh my god, everybody's got me fucking chugging. Give me a Discord message. Now why would you do a thing like that? I'm gonna drink my fucking oiter. I feel like it, I don't know why everybody says oiter, but I like it. Okay, let me check. Let me check my phone. There we go. I see. Yeah, you're gonna be heading out soon. You're be leaving me behind. Oh, I see. Yeah, I have actually seen that. Yeah, worst case scenario. Uh, yeah, when Charlie leaves the house, Beast will come sit with me. I have a funny picture I want to post of her on Twitter. I'll post it after after uh, stream. Yeah, she'll she'll probably just be sitting on my knee and being nice. <laughs> Forgot I could do that. Oh, that's a game changer. Let's go. Let's go, gamers. Huge dub. That's what gamers say, right? <laughs> God, I, 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 if I knew how and could like set it up in a way that I think would be reliable, which I don't because like, you know, there's too many factors to really think of here. I wish I could, like, make it set to, like, kind of recognize the specific frequencies at which Beast chirps and make a little version of her kind of bounce every time she does it. That'd be cute. I don't think that's really feasible with my level of skill with any of this stuff, but it's fun to imagine. Oh, I did lose a few more. There's two here. Yeah, I actually, I actually lost kind of a lot of stuff. That's a shame. Beast voice clips, that would be cute. Yeah, she doesn't like to chirp on command. Okay, I think that's most everything. These fellas will. Yeah, Beastie hates the camera. God, I got such a funny picture of her earlier, though. described her as looking like you know one of the you know those old paintings of like the fat like German monks drinking beer that's the vibe she has in it it's very good Whoa, game hung for a second there yeah sipping men <laughs> She is very much, she has the energy of one of the sipping men. She looks like she's having just the best day of her life. Okay, let's, let's take a look at what we need to expand our house. Actually, let's just, let's look it up really quick. Harvest Moon. Back to nature, house expansion. Okay, let's see. Have to do the hen house first. Okay. That needs uh, 5,000 G and 420 lumber. Nice. Okay.
Nice. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, let's go see about buying some seeds. I'm glad there's an auto run in this game. That's a really nice little feature. Just like holding the run button down just makes you go. It's really nice. Okay. Here we are. Uh, ah, there's some receipts. Yeah, it's a cute little run. Um, let's get more corn. Let's let's check something here. Actually, I want to see how many. Crop growth times. Literally just looking up the times they take to grow. Okay. Here's what I want to do, actually. It looks so sad. Damn. What onions? Hella onions. Yeah, God. All the animations, like everything about this game, like this. I played this game a lot as a kid. This was one of the, like, like I wouldn't call it one of the first games I really connected with, but like of this era, when I think about PS1 games that I loved, this is the first game that really pops up for me. This is this is a game I'm always thinking about, honestly. Let's see. Eh. One of my, uh, pieces of my- <gasps> A mole! Did y'all see that mole? Oh yeah, Tomba. That's a game I fucking love. I uh, almost played Tomba the other day on my uh, like grab bag stream I did. Thought about it. But uh, the other games I was playing just, you know, took precedent. Tomatoes. Yeah, those are... We can we can get these growing too. Here, let's. There. Did I say weapon? Yeah, I did. Oh no, you you did. Okay. Wow. I guess I said it because you said it. Okay. Cool. Okay. <laughs> wow. I am fucked today, gamers. God. This is so uncooperative. 
It's fine. It's a skill issue, you know? I just gotta get good. Warriors, a farmer planting a vegetable for their opponent to eat. The vegetable is good. <laughs> Can't really argue with that. Yeah, the player character is so cute. I've always loved the little the little Harvest Moon guy. I always like. That the more recent ones are let like they let you play as a girl now too, but I also like like I'm glad that option's available, but like I kind of always want to play as the funny little Harvest Moon guy. God, I haven't thought about Mouse Hunt in like actually not that long because Nathan Lane was in that movie and I love that guy. Wait, was there a there was a girl version of Back to Nature? I didn't know that. But yeah, like I like I like huh, I'll have to look up the girl version of this game. I like that they have let you they, they let you play as a girl, but also I like the Harvest Moon boy. I think he's cute and I like playing as him. Also, I want to date girls, and some of them don't let you do that. Oh yeah, Harvest Moon girls are very dateable. We love those. You, you made a PowerPoint presentation about this game when you were in grade seven because you were obsessed with how cute it was. That's so good. That's such a good story. I love that. Charlie, you did the same thing with Cro Legend of the Gavos. Wow, 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 wow. That's fantastic. I love, I love that about you. That's, that's so good. Arsene for girls on PS1 didn't come out in English. That makes sense. I feel like if it had, I probably, yeah, I guess I would know about it then. Sometimes, like, I cycle left and right, and it just doesn't, like, line up. And I'm just like, wait, what is going on here? Okay, you're delivering bird? Okay. Okay, that's all the crop stuff we can do without passing the fuck out today. Let me check something really quick. Harvest Moon is a game I looked into a lot on the internet at the time because I was very sad about Harvest Moon for girls. That makes sense, yeah. Oh, hi, Beastie! Beastie's here. She's like, what are you doing? I don't want to be here. She's trying to get away. Where are you, where are you going? You want to come up my shoulder? Okay. You might be confused uh, about the fact that my voice is coming from two rooms at once. She doesn't care? Yeah, that's fair. Well, if you talk loud enough, Charlie, I'll make my VTuber talk getting body snatched. Yeah, I'm actually pretty sleepy, too. Harvest Moon for girl. All Harvest Moon is for girl. If you want it to be. Yes, you can have a hug. Okay. Let me get my head out of the way. I love you, too. See you later. Still talking in streamer mode, even though... Oh, that's gay! It's gay to say that to chat. <laughs> it's 
<laughs> Sorry about that. It's a little silly. Okay, look at this. There's brush. If I hit left, it's the hammer. If I hit right, it's the seeds. If I hit left, it's the hoe. If I hit right, it's the water. What is going on here? Give anyone the double thank you in real life? <laughs> not, not yet. It's only a matter of time before stream things bleed over into my normal life. Oh, I lost so much stuff in that hurricane. Redeem rhythm game stage for Charlie. Yeah, that's fair. Are these like coming in? No, they're not ready yet. Oh, Dora redeemed play a stage of a rhythm game. Okay, what are we playing today? Give me a sec. Let me lower the volume on this and pull up my list. Uh, uh let's see. I played like a bunch last time because I was like. I, I jokingly said I was running a two-for-one deal. Uh, you know what? Let's do a little bit of a game that I played a little bit of last time, but people genuinely, like, a lot of people haven't seen this game, I kind of realized. One sec. A lot of people have seen this game, but still not as many as you might expect. So, wait, no, game capture doesn't work for this. Ugh. I never know what's going to work for game capture and what I have to use window capture on and so on and so forth. Here you go. Let's play a little bit of the original Rhythm Tengoku. I haven't unlocked every stage on this version yet, so we're gonna plug away at that. Let's do let's do a level. This is the next level I have to unlock. Sometimes uh Sometimes there's the input delay on this version. But that's okay. We'll we'll make it work. So we got this ghost. Yes! Oh my god. Oh, there. that's where we get him. I, yeah, I love all the Rhythm Heaven games so much. If you'll let me skip this. Oh, that, that's, one, that's one way to do it. Just turbo mode. Sure, I cleared that. Yeah. That, that 
was piss poor, so I'll give you two. I wasn't piss poor, but this is also just a really fun level. choked. Let's see if it counted. Okay. Oh, I want to play this one too. That's fine. I want to I want to do good. You know, I'm just embarrassed. This will be the last one and then we'll go back to the game. I might change the name of that uh that redeemed to like rhythm game intermission or something. Probably don't give you the counters. Oh shit. Cheese. That is the longest table in the world. Yeah, I wonder if there's like an English translation for this game, because I I can't read Japanese. Okay. There we go. That was a fun little rhythm game intermission. Yeah, I'll probably change the text. There is one? Oh, that would make sense. Yeah, I should I should definitely look into that. that sounds great. Oh, I love that game. I uh I need to work on I have a 
bunch of games to play for that, but I, uh, a lot of them are, they, like, I don't have saves on them because I you know, can't, like, import the saves I have for those games, so I have to kind of play them fresh, which is a little bit, you know, there's a homework aspect of it. that I have not yet found myself willing to do. Or, frankly, remembering to do. That's my biggest problem. I just don't remember to do things. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it is fun to just kind of go through them as redeems. When I originally came through it, like, came to the idea, I was kind of like, well, maybe I'll just, like, you know, use it as kind of my way of, like, curating a little bit, but also we've got a bunch of rhythm games that I like that would be fun to just kind of play start to finish. Like, um... No, I will never. I will never do kanji reviews. Never, never, never. That's you. That's for you. I... I would... I would flop so badly. Yeah, we'll, we'll keep it sequential then. We'll, uh... We'll have a bunch of rhythm games that we kind of just plug our way through. If that's how you want it, chat, that's how it'll be. Play Ernest Evans? No. Fix my fence? Yes, that I will do. <gasps> oh, fuck, hang on. Before I do that... I know, I know I missed a spot. I just remembered something. Wait. Never mind. This is still day one. I forgot I hadn't slept since the, um... Um, the... Oh, what was I even going to say? My god. I thought I had to go, like, rush some eggs to the inn, but that's tomorrow. Work queen, yeah. I, I quite literally am, yeah. Okay. Let's let's fix this fence. We need quite a lot more lumber to get the upgraded hen house. Oh, thank you for the follow. Got to get my custom uh, sounds made for that. I have some good ones, but I'm going to have to... The game they're from, I'm going to have to go in and actually get, like, get samples of it myself, I'm realizing. The Ernest Evans Rhythm Revival? Yeah, that, uh, that'll be the day. Yeah, thank you. Yeah, I love Harvest Moon. We play a lot of stuff here, but like... This is a childhood favorite. Also, I missed a spot. Where did I? Oh, I see it now. That's not my watering can. <laughs> oh my goodness. <laughs> Good Lord, I am, in... I am struggling truly. Okay. Uh, let's see. Refill that. Yeah, we play a lot of stuff here. Um, a lot of rhythm games. Uh, nice chill stuff. You know, I like management sims like Harvest Moon and a little more complicated stuff like uh, playing Dwarf Fortress on here the other day. That was a fun one. Um, yeah, I'll, I'll play anything. I, I love all kinds of games. There's there's not really any any particular genre I don't play. Except for horror, maybe? I'm not very good at those kinds of games. Tell you is basically a farming game. Yeah, that that makes me want to play it. I uh I've been playing Harvestella. And uh How do I put this? How do I charitably put this? Mm -hmm. 
That game is interesting. I think I do have a hot take, and that I don't think Harvestel is very good. I have a lot of problems with it. I think, as a farming game, it's pretty good. The farming aspect of it is honestly pretty enjoyable. That stuff's cool. Um, my problem is it's... it doesn't... it wants to be that and, a, like, a dungeon crawler in the same way that, like, Rune Factory and those kinds of games are, but it doesn't... I don't feel like it commits hard enough to the farming side of things. It feels like you're not really farming to, like... Okay, let me, like, okay. In Rune Factory, I feel like the har the, like, the farming side of things and the, uh, like, dungeon and, like, combat side of things are pretty evenly matched, you know what I mean? Like, they, they really balance out nicely in a way that really complements each other. Harvestella... I don't feel that way. I feel like in Harvestella, most of what the farming serves to do is give you the items you need to complete side quests or food that you can use as consumables for your uh, dungeon crawling because you burn through your HP and your uh, your like mana equivalent, like your stamina really quick, and it doesn't feel. It, the game feels unpolished. Um, the story has interesting ideas, but there's there's so many side quests in that game that like I had a point where I had to literally just like swear off doing side quests because I kept I had so many that I after a point I was like I just spent the last four hours doing side quests and it, like all of the side quests are just like oh, this kid ran away from home or something. Like, they're all just that, and it's... They're not compelling, and the combat's not fun. It's mashy. It doesn't feel like anything you do means anything. It doesn't feel like you can easily dodge attacks. You have, like, a dodge, but it doesn't give you any iframes, and, like, uh, it just feels like... I just don't think it's a very good game. It feels really unpolished. The combat, it feels sloppily made. Also, there's a lot of really obnoxious voice lines. Yeah, it does feel like they went, oh yeah, we can make one of these. Also, not to be mean to it, but the story direction for it is, like, every five seconds I was just like, this game wants to be near Gestalt so bad. It's like I don't want to like spoil anything, but it it's very near Gestalt. Oh yeah, that's a farming game. You got the uh, what was it? The um, the like plant the flower breeding system in that game. Time to. Figure out how to grow some lunar tears. That's a great video game. But that system in it is a little weird. I've never really understood it. Yeah, I, uh... Yeah. <laughs> I never understood it. These are carrots. Oh, they're onions. Oh yeah, I didn't play the um I didn't play the remake. I should. Oh, I also want to grow onion, tomato, and corn in the summer. Was it three eggs? It was three, right? I'm gonna take all five just to make sure. I also don't remember who I was supposed to give it to. 
The girl is the one who told me, but like, do I bring them to her or do I give them to... Okay, I'm gonna take all five just in case I give one to the wrong person. But yeah, Harvestella... I was really disappointed by it. I feel like a little bit of a hater saying that, but it just... It felt undercooked, and I felt like... I just didn't feel like... I don't think the... I'll, I'll tell you, I actually only just started playing it again, but because I fell off of it months ago, because I had a moment where I, like... Yeah, that's true. It, it's a Square Enix game. Who cares? But, like, God, I had a moment... I was in a dungeon that was really annoying me. There's these enemies in dungeons called FEARS, in all caps, and they're just, like, super over-leveled ma killing machines. And if you run into them at level, they're gonna smoke the shit out of you. So you have to, like, go back to the dungeons at later levels so you can reasonably fight them and get the items they drop. They're, they're FOEs, basically. Yeah, they're basically FOEs. They're, it's even, like, fear like it's an acronym, but they don't tell you what the acronym stands for. They're FOEs. Um, and there was, like, a part where I was, like, climbing this big tower, and in the distance... Like, it, there was, like, a little, a very easy platforming out to, like, a little segment that had, like, a collectible on it. So I go out, and I, like, jump to the thing, get the collectible. It's above, uh, it's on a platform above, like, an area that has two of those guys and, like, a stuff on the ground that slows you and damages you. So I make the jump over there completely effortlessly. I get it, and I turn around, and I have a video of this. You can see it my jump starts and then the animation stops and I fall into the bottom part and then the two like fear guys like stun lock me until I die. And I was like, well I don't think I want to play any more of this game. <laughs> I, uh, I will see about posting the clip. I, I was, I was gamer mad. <laughs> I was so gamer mad. I was tilted. Clock strikes ten, I'll go over to the end. Okay. Digging through my bag looking for onions. Yeah, that game... Uh, there are things I like about it. There are also things that drive me ins insane. I had to set the voices to Japanese, for one, because some of the English dialogue was making me insane. Because there are just, like, things like gathering crops, there are, like, voice lines with them that are, like, full sentences. And then it plays the same voice line every single time you do it, and it, like, clips into itself, and it was making me so crazy that I was just like, holy shit, I... I gotta set this to a language I don't speak. Okay. Yes, I did. Yeah, it's hello little crappies. And it's like one of the little fairies saying it. Every oh, it ah, it drove me insane. It's just it burns it into your skull. I'm I'm fine. I'm fine. I'm fine and I'm normal. Japanese media is so good for normalizing just making noises when you do stuff. Yeah, that's true. It's, and it's like, it's more tolerable in that for me, because it's not a full sentence, 
But in the Japanese version, she just says like one word. That's fine. I can I can handle that. That's whatever. But when it's like a full sentence, I I'm really ragging on this game. I'm sorry. Yeah, I I fully scream. Let's fucking go every time I pluck an onion out of the ground. That's just true. That's true. I am so hyped for the beauty of the world. Actually, hey, let's go back out here because I remembered something. Let's go talk to the elves. says let's fucking go whenever you pick up an item and when you toss it in the bin you go yeet oh god you two doing hi all right cool good good talk my bird oh what are you doing hey go talk to the gnomes finally a harvest moon for zoomers yeah oh this music rules also Water some more. This will take one week starting tomorrow. Yeah, you're a zoomer. Sorry. I'll make the rules. Oh no. That's fine. You can water the fields and that'll be fine. You'll love it. me both, bud. You are going to take care of the animals. I think that's for that one. Wait. Oh, right. That's for like... That's for like milking and stuff. You're gonna help water them. Too bad. It's all week. Okay. We have now recruited some elves. are arranged like they're having a tribunal. Maybe they are. You ever think of that? God, I'm so bad at, like, remembering to, like, socialize in these games. Genuinely, like, one of the hardest things for me. I get too caught up, like, doing all my, like, crops and, and animals and stuff, and I forget to, like, figure out what people like and give them the gifts they need. Even in, like, Stardew, a game that I feel like is a lot more, I don't want to say player-friendly, because I feel like, I don't think this game is player-unfriendly. Like, you know, everything's very streamlined in that game, and even there, I'm just like, oh god, I don't fucking have any clue what any of these people like.
Yeah, show where they are on the map is important. I figure out which of these are watered. The answer is not many of them, actually. I just, I can't keep track of that stuff. It's easier once I have my farm established and I can, like, kind of, like, go, okay, now I've got, like, a greenhouse and I can kind of grow stuff all year so I can kind of reliably grow stuff that I know villagers like and then I can have a, you know, it's, I need the supply chain set up before I really start, like, thinking about making friends, you know? probably says a lot about how I play these kinds of games. You should have seen me when I got into Dyson Sphere program. That, that was a hell of a time. I don't recommend that to anybody. a handful of things that everybody loves. Yeah, that's true. There's like one exception usually, just to fuck you. One person who's like, wow, I fucking hate that shit. And you're just like, what's your fucking... What's your problem? The yeah, Dyson Sphere program ate, ate like a month of my life straight up. Or like two weeks. I was having like dreams about it every night. I would close my eyes and I would see conveyor belts. Apparently they're adding enemies to it, which makes me interested, but also anxious. Okay, let's take our chickens back inside. Yeah, I like... I like that. I like Dyson Sphere a lot. I, ugh. I wonder how well it would stream. Maybe I'll uh, play it sometime. Wanna, kind of want to just do variety streams where I just like I have. There's you know there's so much on Game Pass that I'm like. There's a lot of fun stuff I could just be like yeah fuck it here's what we're doing today and just hit a button and pull something up. But I also don't want to just like start a million games and not finish them. You know what I mean? I like being able to say, like, here are the games I have completed. I I put a little list on my profile page, like, down under the stream, you'll see it, and it's like... <laughs> it's funny, there's a part that says, like, you know, ongoing games, and some of those are games that are things that I will clear and move to the thing, and some of them are games that are physically impossible to fully complete, like... You know, I'm gonna be not going to be ever moving Destiny to completed games. Uh, speaking of which, uh, enjoy in like a month from today the new expansion comes out and I'm going to make myself crazy streaming that. I'm going to do the uh, campaign for it on the max difficulty uh, blind. I think that'll actually be a really fun stream. Did I miss any crops? I think I got everything. I think we're good. I'm actually very excited to uh, stream that. Because you may know this about me. That is a game I care quite a lot about. Puppy. I need to go brush my horse. Well, no, it's already late enough that I don't think it'll matter. I'll do it in the morning. Brush my horse in the morning. Wait, we got to go to bed. It's 11 p.m. It's too damn late. Oh, I just remembered another game I need to be able to do for rhythm games. Uh, I don't have the Steam version of, or maybe I no, I have it on a, I have the Switch version, but I got my 
capture card back. So I can set that up sometime. I think a Sayonara Wild Hearts would be a really good rhythm game to do for the intermission. Holy shit, that game is cool. Cow Festival. Yeah, that game is really amazing. Like, holy shit. <gasps> Tomatoes! Oh, Thumper would be good. Do I have Thumper? Oh, God! I'm... Okay, I'm good. Thumper would be good. Yeah, I'm, I'm perfectly open to suggestions. I, uh... Yeah. You know, anything that I can ha can play easily that I, you know, have access to, I I will do so. But uh yeah, mostly games that I like really love, but honestly, if you suggest something, there's a solid chance that I'll go like, "Oh shit, right, I love that game. Why didn't I think of that?" Nope, I don't love Rhythm Thief. <sighs> do I? Maybe I do. Maybe I do love it. Oh. That, now that is a cursed thing to say. Dr. Latrec might be the maddest I've ever gotten at a video game. That game is evil. Why? Like, I can't think of any game more designed to personally make me angry than the idea of a, like, stealth Sokoban game. And that's what that is. It's stealth Sokoban. It's deranged. Torturous is the right word for it, yeah. And then it has, like, some kind of weird, like, Pokemon battle system. And then the main character's, like, a dick. He's, like... He's, like, if Professor Layton just negged Luke every chance he got. Damn, that game is fucked. <laughs> now, Boktai is... Boktai is cool. <laughs> Damn. Got all these onions and tomatoes. Yeah, it's a 3DS game. I don't remember the subtitle. It's like Dr. Trek and something. It's, you know. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Hold on. Let's not... Hold on. Let's not be talking shit on Henry Hatsworth, okay? I'm, let's not go that far, all right? That game is good. That game's really good. Henry Hatsworth is a disturbingly good game. Yeah, that game rules. It's it's a platformer. It's like, oh my god, Beast is fucking screaming. She did not like me raising my voice. Sorry if you heard that. Um, Henry Hatsworth is a platformer and puzzle game at the same time in the sense of top screen, you are playing a platformer. Bottom screen, you are managing an ever-rising, like, endless mode uh, puzzle league, like... Like, Tetris Attack board, basically. And if it gets too high up, it starts fucking with you in the platforming section. Whoa, what's going on out here? Uh... What? Wait, what am I do? What is... Are these tomatoes?
Oh, she's mad. It's tomato festival. I didn't, I thought, I did look at my count. I just missed this, I guess. Okay, who are we joining up with? Oh my God, he's gonna kill everybody. Okay, who are we joining with? Uh, I guess we have the option of uh, Pofuri. Is this Anne? Uh, well, that hits hard. <laughs> no, <laughs> I feel bad. Is that Anne or is that? Uh, let me look it up. I there's a few. There's a few girls in this game, as there tend to be in Harvest Moon games. Uh, let me take a look. Yeah, that's, uh, yeah, this is Anne. Yeah. Um, now, we could join her. We could join Potpourri. Um, we could join... Uh, who is she? This is, uh, Ellie. Okay, this is Ellie. Yeah. What am I saying? What are you? Listen. I don't know what to tell you. Or am I joining up with, um, I don't remember her name, the mom. Oh, wait, I can't go back and like go. OK, I'll join. What do you mean? I can't just like go and be like. Why? I did. Did I alienate everyone? <sighs> God. Okay, well. Here's what we're doing. I just saved. This fucking game. Give it a second. It'll show up on the screen share again. No, I'm no, I'm not going to just let it happen. I I, I will not let this game win. There we go. This, I can't believe that. I can't believe that. If it was if it was immersive, then I could go. Oh, I don't know who I'm joining yet. I hey, they don't know I didn't remember their names. There was no way they could know that. Okay. There was no way for them to know that. Now I have to pick all these fucking tomatoes again. The 
nice is torture. I thought this was going to be a nice... Nice chill stream, I said on Twitter. Nice just... I'm sleepy, so we're going to have... We're going to take it real easy. We're just going to have a nice one. Just play a little Harvest Moon, you know? Just, just play a little... Just play a little Harvest Moon. Okay, okay, fine. You know what? Okay, this way we have time to decide who we're joining. I still haven't decided who I, like, want to date in this game yet. Oh my god, yeah, the putting stuff in your back sound is so good. a kid i always i remember when i played this game i remember who i picked and i'm like do i want to pick her again but you know now i'm grown i have different i have different tastes now i'm being intentionally vague about who i picked because I kind of want to make people guess. I think it's funny to make people guess about shit like that. It, yep. Ruby got it in one. It was Maria. I always, I always picked Maria. You literally got it in one. Fucking easy. <laughs> I don't know why you say that. Maybe it was because I was like, oh, I have dark hair and glasses. She just like me for real. Right? You know? Okay, so doing that, like, started the tomato thing. So I'm going to try taking a different route. Anne was a was the tomboy and just like you for... Yeah, that, that checks out. That makes sense. I... I think I know who I want to go with. All, of the, all three of the girls that were there, like, already like me. They already have... Or wait, no, purple is like, yeah, purple is like the first step of them liking you. Like, it starts black and then it goes up to purple. I don't know if this is actually going to work today. Yeah, this is locked, so. Hey! Hey! Chilling in the tub, that's basically like being on the beach. Yeah, true. That's that's very similar. Okay, here's what I think. Hmm. I think we'll go with Ellie. Also, she seems like she needs my help because it's her and a literal child. Been Googling these girls for 20 years. <laughs> That's a really just good sentence. What? 
Yeah, Karen's fun too, because she's like, got a lot going on. Okay, I think I get it. Do we wanna, do we wanna try to save scum this or do we wanna just let it roll? What do y'all think? Leaving that one up to the chat. I'm jamming to this music too. I think, uh, I think we should probably just, let's just let it rock. Like, I don't think we need to make a save state. For the sheep team? Or the chicken team? for winning is so good. Kid got sm Wait, it's a draw? Oh. oh. having to target people. Okay, we can, we can win this. We got this in the bag, y'all. I think we can do this. Holy shit! <laughs> we... <laughs> that was... That was a blowout. <laughs> God. Hey, we won. have the same dialogue, okay. Hmm. I think she's hitting on me. Everybody doing? What you play tonight, Gomi? You were playing um, Shinmyo, right? Yeah. 
Hi, everybody. I'm Nadia. I'm, uh, a little, I'm a funny little possum VTuber. Playing Harvest Moon tonight. Play a lot of stuff here. How'd, uh, how'd Shinryu go? I think I uh, caught a minute of it earlier when you were doing the, uh, the darts. Oh, you got the fork? You got to the forklifts? Hell yeah. That potpourri is cute. Damn, 510, good shit. Oh. oh, thank you for the follow. And we're uh we're pretty new here. The uh, I've been I've been streaming a little bit for a while, but uh kind of just getting into the swing of things in earnest lately. Sorry if uh if you hear a loud noise, loud high pitched noise, my uh my cockatiel is sitting on my shoulder for this stream. Yeah, she has a lot to say sometimes. My noise gate usually catches her, but she's a little she's a little beepy girl. I'll uh I'm gonna tweet a picture of her in a minute. I uh follow me on Twitter at the same same uh ID as I am on here. She is a farm animal, that's so true. No, I just <gasps> Oh, are you gonna fuck me like this game? Okay, no, we're good, we're good. I really thought that ro that hammer was gonna, like, my hammer wasn't strong enough to break that rock, so I wasn't gonna be able to water one of my onions. That's on netting the Critter Guild Cove Twitter account. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, you know, I worked really hard at it. I had to had to pay somebody off for it. <laughs> you know, uh, really, real shady feelings. Wait, do you not? Do you not have it? I didn't realize. Oh yeah, huh? Wait, hold on. Do you really not have that? It's crazy. Oh, that's right. Yeah, you have that version of it. That's right. That's right. Yeah, I uh lucked out getting and picking a name that no one on God's green earth has ever had or wanted to have. I enjoy it because it means anytime I follow or subscribe or anything to anyone on Twitter, they have to struggle to pronounce my name. It's like genuinely one of the highlights of it. I think uh, this, the name was Charlie's idea. She's better at those kinds of things than me. That is the power of alliteration. Doors coated with zeros and threes. That's true. Definitely true. Oh, I guess I can't deliver the eggs I need to today. Did I get all my crops watered? I think uh, I think my little buddies here did a good job on it. Love those guys. Let's uh let's see. We can use a little bit more of our energy. Still have a decent amount of stamina today. My skin is moisturized and my crops are thriving. That's that's so true. So true, bestie. I feel like an alien when I say those things. Not because I have a problem with them, but because I it just doesn't it's not something you expect me to say, I think. I'm gonna get really into saying oomphy like everybody does. No, never mind. Tom's here. I'm not saying oomphy anymore. Ever heard that word in your life? Yeah, good. <laughs> Let's keep it that way. I don't know what you're saying to me, Tom. Yeah, this is a this is a good turn-taking game. 
<laughs> the Mario impact noise. Yeah, true. Base, I, there's, what are you? I feel like every time I've ever seen the like chart, that's like the three different phrases, like, you know, based on what, tell me a shrimp fried this rice apartment complex, I find it quite simple that people use for like every like set of three characters. I have never in my life been more of anything than the person who goes based. Based on what? <laughs> what are you fucking saying to me? Yeah, Oomphy and Biffy are player one and player two in a Data East game. Biffy is Oomphy, but BFF? Oh, I don't know about that. I, I'm, I, I'm not sold on it. No, you're right. I've, I've heard people say that a couple times actually. I think it's come up on some streams. That doesn't make it not completely deranged though. I want to make that clear. If you know, if you know, people can keep using it, and if it gets off the ground, awesome. I probably won't say it, but then again, I, I, yeah. Oh God, it is two a.m. I gotta go. I got too distracted by this fucking oofy and biffy nonsense that y'all are talking about in my chat. We'll call you Giffy. Oh, that's good. I like that. Do you like? Well, okay. Do you like that? Because if you like that, I like that. If you don't like it, then I don't like it. But I think I think I can I can see the appeal. Trying your HVI instantly instantly by dropping Bishy in the chat. Yeah. Slang for toilet. And I don't. I've never heard that. I'm not convinced. I am unconvinced. <laughs> Beast is unconvinced too. Okay. Dog. Yeah, my little farmer out in the fields hacking angrily at weeds and grumbling about Oomphy. This is these are Oomphy and Biffy, these guys. Hey the mayor's here. What's up, dude? Uh, sure. Apple pie from the inn. Well, I gotta go to the inn anyway. God, ugh. I don't know if I want to name my fucking farm animals. Oomphy and... Biff... Ugh. I'll do it. But I won't be happy about it, you know? Can defy destiny? I'm not. Hey. 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 <laughs> you, I, hey. I don't know about that one. Every Tuesday, right? That's the joke. Because I play that game on Tuesdays. All the chickens norted. Oh, Jesus. Well, lucky for me, I'm probably not going to get any more chickens today. Yeah, I, I can't defy Destiny or my computer will crash. I have something's wrong with my PC where, like, I think I have, like, a bad sector of RAM or something like that. And, uh, if for some reason, if my graphics card isn't like active and like doing something so like any i usually have a game open like for some reason my computer will just occasionally blue screen so all my friends joke about how like i i leave destiny open on my pc all the time <laughs> no it's not dude <laughs> 
uh, like if I don't keep a game open, like my computer will crash. Everyone jokes about that fact that my computer runs on Destiny and needs it to survive, which maybe not completely false. Okay, we got some eggs. Hosting their servers, yeah, that would make sense. Ugh. Oh yeah, um, I wanted to talk about next week's streams a little bit. Oh yeah, TF2, like, I wonder how many, I'm gonna just look at my Steam and see how many hours I have in Team Fortress 2. Yeah, I have, oh wow, that's actually way less than I thought. It's only 222 hours. That's a lot less than how many I thought it would be and how many I have in Destiny 2. I thought that was gonna be done. Okay. Team hours are messed up sometimes? Yeah, that makes sense. Uh, for reference, my Destiny 2 playtime is 4,532. That is only since it went to Steam. So for the first two years of the game, any hours that I have aren't counted. Because the game was on Battle.net for the first two years, and then in year three, it went over to Steam instead. So, actually probably more. Significantly more. Not. Steam only started tracking hours in March 2009. Oh, that's interesting. I didn't know that. Yeah, this is the this is extremely the kind of music you do a three frame dance to. I like this music too. Gotta go to the inn and deliver these eggs. up because I'm I don't want to fuck this up and I feel like I'm constantly fucking things up with this game <laughs> okay let's see harvest moon back to nature three eggs yeah. It's after 6 p.m. Okay. And the character I need to be delivering this apple pie to is pretty sure the grandma over here. Wait, after 6 p.m.? But I thought I delivered it at, like, noon. Ah! I'm so confused. This is the wrong place. This game's kind of confusing, huh? Ah, okay, here she is. saying I was sweating.
I'll take that tip. I don't know how she gave me. But. Grandma didn't give me the egg, so that was the animation of me pulling them out of my, uh, backpack. Like, you cycle through by... <laughs> yeah, picking things out with, uh, R2. i gonna water my crops a little bit more. Actually, let's go. Oh man, play the GBA Harvest Moon at bedtime and you can listen to the red hot chili peppers on your disc, man. Oh, fuck yeah. Hell yeah. That's, that's a good, that's a good memory. Oh man, I love that. Out of water. Glad the sprites are here helping me water my crops. Very nice of them. That, that is vibing. That is like peak vibe. You know? There's nothing better. Okay, I'm gonna see if I can uh, chop down a few more stumps. Did I do that today or yesterday? I don't remember. That no, was yesterday. Oh, squirrel. I could upgrade my, uh, my axe again, I think, if I get some, uh... Did I already fuck up the, uh, egg thing, do you think? Wow, sorry, my attention's all over the place this time. I'm gonna try going back over to the, uh, the inn one more time. You know, it said after five on the thing I read, but I'm pretty sure it was supposed to be before five. Oh, God, I don't know. Inn was closed on Tomato Day. Right? Fuck. <laughs> uh, I don't know. Harvest Moon is a nightmare game. Go back in one more time before five. Yep, okay. Wow. It's because the other event was. Wow, I am glad I tried this because turns out the other event where I had to get the apple pie was interfering with it. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Yep. What a video game. God, 
that is really funny. I... Uh, what a what a game. Let's check something. I think I can get my axe upgraded again. Closed on there. Open on every day but Thursday. Okay. It's all quiet now. Okay, take the chickens back inside. I'm still thinking about the food I had for lunch. The local Hawaiian place. It was like... Oh, it was delicious. But the line was like... It was out the door and like down the street. And it was worth it. It was worth every second of that wait. Uh, anywhere that you can go and you can get a takeout box full of food that is so jam-packed with food that they have to take a rubber band to hold the takeout box shut because there's just so much food in it that it won't snap shut other otherwise. That's the dream. <laughs> I really like that you are making up emotes for me here, Doro. I will, I will probably, like, genuinely, like, pick your brain and a few other streamer pals about, like, emote ideas. Picked up American Chinese today and they gave you the wrong order so you end up getting food for two people? Hell yeah. Oh, that, that's the good shit. Oh, I love, I love Chinese food. American Chinese is such a comfort food for me. I feel like, you know, Hawaiian has a lot of the same kind of, you know, um, like East Asian kind of stuff that like Chinese and Japanese food do. And I'm such a sucker for that. My, uh, my favorite dish as a kid was, um, there was a little Chinese place down the road back home in Alabama for me. Um, and it, uh, the thing I would always get. It was just called chicken and brown sauce on the menu, and I was never really sure what that was, but like it was, it was basically like General So's. I mean, not General So's, uh, Kung Pao, and Kung Pao chicken was always my favorite. And the, I found out the recipe for what they did when I was a kid, and I have since like you know learned to recreate it, and it was life changing. I, I make it all the time now. Actually, it's just um, you take. Some beef stock, oyster sauce, um, and then like some sriracha is what I usually put in it. Let me make sure I don't. Yeah, like beef stock, oyster sauce, a little bit of ginger, some sriracha, a little bit of sugar. And um, soy sauce, a little bit of soy sauce. And some cornstarch to kind of let it thicken up. It's pretty similar to what you, what you put on like beef and broccoli, yeah. Oh, perfect. Yeah, and it's just like, it's chicken, you know, sautéed with uh, some roasted peanuts, and then you throw that sauce in with some cornstarch so it thickens up nice. And that is just like, that is the ultimate comfort food for me. I 
love it. I, I make it still very often, actually. Um, every Saturday, one of my partners comes over, and I cook dinner for us. And earlier today, I was like, what do you want me to make? And I made that for them last week, and this week they were like, Nadia, you could just... You could just make that every single week and I would be happy. And I was like, all right, cool. <laughs> Will do. <laughs> so that's what I'm making tonight. Let's do, let's do one more day of this. And then uh, we'll wind down. We'll talk about uh, my stream schedule for next week. Beastie, what are you doing? I'll, I'll tweet a picture of Beastie for you. I I would just turn on my camera, but I you know don't want to give up the illusion. That I'm a funny possum. Oh, it's a fucking hurricane again. This is what I get for not checking the damn... <sighs> what I check for not... This is what I get for not checking the weather. I don't want to, like, have a save just on a day where I can't do anything, so... Ugh. Hurricanes. You want to know something else about Harvestella that drove me crazy? There were... Okay, so there are fucking, like... Like, there are a bunch of crops that are... Like, most of the crops in that game are plantable in several seasons, because there's no, like, greenhouse in that game. But for some reason, they, like, they... Oh, hang on. Hey, dude. Aw. Wait. I don't get to, like, keep it? And, like, eat it when I need the stamina? Okay. I expected more than that. <laughs> oh, hi! Thank you for the follow! Playing Harvest Moon. Let's see, okay, I actually don't have any room in my shit for this shit. <laughs> um, let's see. Let's go over here. We're gonna brush our horse really quick, and we'll uh, we'll cut that grass. Horse. Gotta get out of the way. Okay. Yeah, get up, weather bad, straight to bed. That is that is the vibe sometimes. Like back when I lived in the part of the country that got hurricanes, that was not something I was you know unaccustomed to. Really get them on the west coast, but the east, southeast coast, like Gulf Coast, it was like, oh, god. You get the leftovers from hurricanes in Georgia. Yeah, that's that makes sense. You were a little more inland than I was. Weren't you? I mean, I wasn't like super close to the coast, but. Not terribly far. God, it fucked up my corn. So sad. Oh, the mosquitoes. Oh, God. I do not miss that. <whistles> Haven't seen many of those since leaving. 
Yeah, honestly, I the thing I miss the least about moving out of the southeast is storms in general. I I don't get a lot of them up in the Pacific Northwest. We get rain, but we don't get just, like, thunderstorms up here very much. Okay, let's see. There we go. Well, they won't let me watch him work. Okay, that'll uh, that'll upgrade our axe to silver. Nice thing about this game is like I I always run into these situations where it's like in these kinds of games where it's like I want to upgrade my watering can, but if I don't if I don't have my watering can, I can't water my crops. So you know it becomes a problem. But here we have the. Uh, the harvest sprites will honestly they'll do all this work for me if I let them. I can just sell the rest of this ore because I don't actually have any kind of storage to put it in. Pretty sure. be a bad chicken mom and just put the feed in the box this time because I'm <laughs> frankly over taking them in and out of the coop every single time right now. Sure, I'm sure you can understand. I love this music, though. Do you have any mail? Yeah, the, uh, back to the hurricane concept. Yeah, like, God, it, I remember when, uh, Hurricane Opal happened. I think that was in, like, 98 or something? I remember huddling in the damn bathtub with a, like, I think we had a mattress covering the bathtub because we were afraid that, like, it was gonna fuck up our house. Like a tree would fall or something. It didn't. We were okay. But, oof. Scary stuff. That's why I'm so anxious about storms. One of my partners is from Virginia, and she's always like, oh, I I always miss the thunderstorms. They're so calming, and I'm like, every time there was a thunderstorm, I got freaked the fuck out. Like, I, I, underst I understand the appeal, but, like, oof, for me, it was... scared the shit out of me. Yeah, that was, like, apparently the thing to do. Like, everybody would suggest that. I, like... If I'm listening to, like, a thunderstorm, like, white noise kind of thing, like, if I'm just, like, listening to a recording of a thunderstorm, I love that shit. But when there's actually one happening where I am, I get, I get really anxious. I'm like, uh, I'm like a nervous dog, you know?
What else can we do here? Hey. Hi. Damn, all the girls have purple hearts on me now. Wonder if I just did more last stream than I remembered or, or something. Funny. Yeah? Beast is chirping at me. Oh man, last time the power went out, me and my roommates played Mario Party on the Switch in Portable Mode. That was really funny. All staring at a tiny screen. That's that's kind of great. Like that's the that's such a good story. I love that. You guys like done? We <laughs> bud. That all? The Switch trailer's promised, yeah. Because the last one the game required you to do ground pound Z is unmapped on GameCube controller and Switch doesn't let you remap GameCube. Wha what? <laughs> so it was just physically impossible for them because the button wasn't there? livid straight up love slicing that's so funny God, that's such a good story. Let's uh, cut down weeds until it gives me the like falling over tired animation. And then we'll go to bed and then we'll talk for a minute about uh, next week's stream plans. There's our falling down. I like every once in a while it like hangs for a second. Like it has to load the animation or like load certain uh, sound effects, like the bell ringing when the time changes and stuff like that. Let me make sure there's nothing else for these guys to do. Y'all water everything. Yeah, they're chilling now. What's right here, bud? Uh, whatever. You're fine. Need to tinker with the fish stuff at some point, too. Okay. There we go. Okay. Let's, uh, let's say, let's check the weather. Let's check the fucking weather. Okay, it's sunny. We're good. Uh, check the calendar. Nothing of note. If beast chirps were one word, same word each time, what would that word be? Probably hey. That sounds most like her. She just wants attention. Isn't that right, baby? Yeah? Hey, what are you doing? Oh. She's uh she's on my shoulder now. Oh, now she's on my boob. Where are you going? Ah. She's on my stomach. Okay. There she goes. She was trying to get down to my knee. Can you say hi? I don't know if that came through. I hope it did. Hi. Aww. 
Uh, <laughs> she's really cute. Okay. That's all for now. Let's talk about next week. Um, I'm not sure exactly what my plans will be. I'll probably throw a schedule together and have it out tomorrow. I want to play Hi-Fi Rush. I really, 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 really want to play Hi-Fi Rush. That's the, like, rhythm brawler game that Tango just put out. Shinji Mikami, direct, like, produced it. And it's, like, from the guy who directed Evil Within 2, I think. Yeah, it's... It... Oh, I want to play it. So, we're going to play that this week. Yeah, it looks really good. It was on Game Pass, and I have Game Pass, so I'm gonna I'm gonna play that shit. Uh, yeah. So, Hi-Fi Rush. Um, I kind of want to do a tier list stream. I don't know if I'll do that this week or like in the coming weeks, but before terribly long. Um, that will be an interesting one because I have a bunch of stupid things to do on it. One of the tier list things I want to do is I want to just go through the entire Twitter. The, like U.S. regional foods Twitter and just declare would or would not about everything on there. Uh, that, that's one of the things I'm gonna do on the tier list uh, stream. Yeah, smash or pass, but for fucked up American food. <laughs> yeah, I can't wait to for you to yell at me on that, Ruby. That'll be a really fun one. Yeah, U.S. regional food smash or pass is a part of that stream. Uh, if anybody wants to just like send me tier lists on like discord or twitter please do and i'll save a list of them and we'll go through them you can you can get me to have opinions on some stupid shit <laughs> i probably end up doing one of the tier lists being like destiny or wow or final fantasy 14 expansions and shit like that well uh, yeah any any topic that i could per perceivably have an opinion on is open for tier list submission. So if anybody has any ideas, please send those to me because that sounds really funny. Um, yeah, that, Hi-Fi Rush. Um, maybe play more Patapon? Maybe play some more PS1 games? Kind of want to get back to Silent Bomber because that game's super sick. Probably don't want to get back to Magic Carpet as much as I liked it. Stop chewing on my shirt, beast. Um, yeah, I think that's the plan for next week. Um, so yeah, we'll call it there. Um, that's the plan for next week. Expect a schedule up, uh, either in the next couple hours or like tomorrow. God. <laughs> okay. Uh, sorry. I got distracted. Um, yeah, I, that's why I, the, I, you sent me a tier list and I got distracted because I saw it and I said, oh God, uh, <laughs> I mean, we'll do it. I just might have to go only on my visual, like, opinions of how they look. Because I haven't played that game. But I would like to. That sounds like a fun game to play. Um, I'm going to try to get one of my little collab streams going. Um, a good friend of mine, my friend Angie, Charm Witch on Twitter, has been wanting to do... We've been wanting to do Wild Arms 2, so maybe we'll start that in the coming weeks. Uh, my partner, Bell, wants to do a... Uh, yeah, yes. That is exactly what happened, Doro. Yeah. Uh, my partner, Bell, wants to do a Wind Waker randomizer stream. And that would be fun. So we'll do that sometime soon. Good. I'm glad they made you do that one, too. That's fucking hilarious. Um, yeah, we'll do it. We'll do it. That'll be great. I, I will straight up save it for this. Uh, yeah, so those are upcoming things. Um, other than that, who knows? I don't. I uh, might have a Destiny thing I want to do. Okay, so bear with me. This is stupid, and everybody's going to be like, God, Nadia, shut up. But, like, if you're familiar with the concept of, like, a Pokemon uh, Nuzlocke run, you know, you start with Pokemon, you catch the first thing you see. Um, you catch the first thing you see. You use it if it... You know, you you know that you know the idea. Everybody fucking knows what a Nuzlocke run is. There's a thing people do for that in Destiny with the campaign that is for the year that is ending. Like the current campaign, the hardest difficulty. There's like a thing where people go through it, starting with just like the worst gear in the game, and you can only use what you pick up in the campaign. And I think that would be a really fun way to kind of end the year of destiny because the new expansion comes out in a month from today 
so I think that would be really fun. That might be a very self-indulgent just for Nadia kind of stream, but I think it'll be fun, and I would like to do that at some point uh, as a stream uh, before uh, Lightfall comes out. Yeah, that's that's my thing. It's very self-indulgent. I think it'll be fun, though. Um, that's it. That's everything. That's everything I had to say today. Um, my throat is actually getting sore from talking so much. Um, thank you so much, everyone, for coin for joining. And if you're still here, Golmi, thank you so much for rating. Very much appreciate it. Thank you, all followers and everything. Um, expect a thing to go up on my uh, Twitter in the next few hours or tomorrow uh, with a schedule. And I'll see you tomorrow or Monday for some Hi-Fi Rush. Thank you, everyone. I hope you all have a wonderful night. And I will see you again soon. Let's see, uh, one sec. Yeah, we'll just, uh, we'll call it there. No raid tonight. Uh, I don't really have much going on the way that I could see, at least. Um, but yeah, uh, see you next Monday. See you on Monday or tomorrow or something. See you when, see you when I see you. We'll, we'll have fun either way. Bye, everybody. Good night. <laughs>